story begins with a girl named Lucy, who used to work as a translator in Japan when she came to work today her friend tells that the police found the body of a girl, they think that the body belongs to Lily, this disturbs Lucy a bit. Police take Lucy to the police station to talk to her, police said the night Lily had arrived that was the last time she met you, Lucy said that both of us were just talking police says you went after her with an umbrella, Lucy said that I went after her but I could not find her, then police asked Lucy about her boyfriend then she said that now I am single, we are shown flashbacks from the boyfriend talk when first time he meet her. When she was passing through a road, a photographer takes her photo without her permission, this is our other main character and his name is Teji she said that in this way you take photos without permission, are people not angry about this Teji says I never take permission or else, my photo gets spoiled and anyway I don't take photos of people he always used to take photos of nature, but he liked Lucy. After this in hotel where Teji work, they both go there on the first date, Lucy is trying to talk on different topics like this. Teji says people always never talk about what happens in their mind they keep talking here and there I think we can both be honest with each other he had a feeling as soon as he saw Lucy for the first time, Lucy also feels this right. Teji said that what is going on in your mind now, Lucy says soup is not good here I should not have come with you on this date, but still I liked you very much that's why she came with him. Teiji also liked this thing very much. Teiji says I have to take your photos after this Teiji brought her to the house Lucy sees all his photos which were very amazing Teiji does not ask her to do any pose, in same way he takes out very amazing photos suddenly there was an earthquake. So both of them hide in a cupboard there are many earthquakes in Japan anyway. Let's see in the next scene Lucy used to do violins class 2 so she had friends there, today was her birthday her friends gave her a gift. At night Lucy met an American friend. His friend says that I want to introduce you to a girl, he wanted Lucy to help her find her house that girl's name was Lily, Lucy does not like this very much because if she starts taking care of everyone then her life will not last Lily was very friendly when she met Lucy she says I don't know the language so because of this it is very hard to find home and mix with each other, in next scene we see Teji develop Lucy's photos which looked very beautiful one day Lucy was telling her friend about Teji, Friend asks did you two become intimate Lucy says nothing like that. Teji hasn't moved on Lucy with that type yet one night when he was taking Lucy's photo. She starts taking off her clothes Teji said I didn't ask you to do all this. Lucy does not understand Teji in the next scene Lucy was with her friend Kato who was also her teacher. She gifts him a Japanese dress Lucy was looking very beautiful. Lucy asked Kato that you are so old but why did you not get married? Kato says that I am very educated because of this Japanese men do not like me, I don't have much time anyway she had developed her life well. While she was talking, a friend came from stairs, her name was Yamamoto so Lucy goes to say hello to her, Yamamoto surprised and fell down from stairs she would have died instantly due to the injury, Lucy was greatly disturbed by this when she meets Teji at night. She tells him all this she said that wherever I go death is always with me. Teji then shows some photographs to Lucy when his auntie died he took the photographs, he says I can understand your pain I have always been near death after this. He kisses her and both become intimate. Lucy was telling all these stories to the police, again in the flashback we see that Lucy shows Lily the house. Lily immediately likes the house and takes the house on rent after that both went to the restaurant. Lily did not even know how to order coffee here so Lucy taught her both become friends. One night while Lucy and Teji were together Teji was developing photographs after which he locks them in one place. Lucy said that whatever you have kept locked will you ever show me. Teji says this time will come then I will show you everything. One day Lucy went hiking with her American friend and talks about Teji there. She says that both of us are very different but when both of us are together we enjoy well, while coming back, Lucy's foot slipped she was hurt so Lily helps her, Lucy said what do you know about it, Lily said that I was not always jobless she used to work as a nurse in America, Lucy talks more about Teji then Lily says can I meet him Lucy says yes to this, one night when Lucy and Teji are together Lucy said you take so many amazing photos, so why don't you sell them Teji refuses to do so. But as Lucy was trying to force it Teji got very angry, he says I have to go to work now. Lucy leaves Teji at work but now she was curious that Teji is hiding something from her. She directly comes to Teji's house checks all her files in his cupboard. There was a file named after a girl on which all her photos were there Lucy became more disturbed than this. Then Teji reached there Lucy asked who is this girl Teji said my ex-girlfriend Lucy asked what happened. 
Teji says that she left me one day and then did not come back when I met you I stopped thinking about her. Lucy says sorry to Teji few days later Lucy comes to meet Teji with Lily. Teji asks can we all go somewhere Lily gets excited for this and they go to different places. Lily told Lucy that Teji is so handsome he doesn't look like other Japanese boys after coming home she says that Teji likes you a lot. Lucy liked this very much Lily says that I see people's lives by looking at their hands. She says looking at Lucy's hand I am seeing accident incident in this type of event, suddenly she looks different her expressions have changed Lucy asks what did you see? But Lily doesn't tell her there was a sudden earthquake in the night Lily was scared so Lucy supported her, on waking up the next morning Lily said that I slept very well last night Lucy said that earthquake had caused more disturbance but Lily had completely forgotten about it. She was not asleep when the earthquake struck but still forgot about it after this Lucy felt a bit strange. Lucy asks Teji one day can we go to the club there will be my friends too Teji also agreed to this. Teji went to get drinks Lucy talks to a friend his friend says that Lily is weird. Sometimes a lot of things happen between us but Lily always forgets about it she behaves as if nothing has happened. At the party we can see that Lily and Teji were dancing with each other both come closer. Lucy doesn't like it she tells Teji about it then Teji says that Lily is a very good dancer, so I was just dancing with her what's wrong with that. While coming home Lucy asked Teji about his past relationship Teji says that he had only one girlfriend in the past. Teji asks when was your first time Lucy says that I was 14 years old went to my friend's house his father gave me a drink friend had gone out a bit, so friend's father took advantage of that it is very bad to hear Teji. Lucy says after that I became pregnant when I told this to my friend's father he committed suicide. Later Lucy came to know that she was not actually pregnant hearing all this. Teji gives her support this is the reason why Lucy feels that death and accidents follow her wherever she goes. She blaming herself for Yamamoto's death. Teji and Lucy were asked by Lily for a weekend so they go. Although Teji was always busy but ready to come here when all these people were talking at dinner. Lily says that it was my mission to save people when I was a nurse people used to die in this but still she wanted to help everyone this was the difference between Lucy and Lily. Lily always taking everything positive and Lucy always blaming herself. In the night, Lucy had a dream that the three were getting intimate together Lucy was a bit disturbed by this it seemed that Teji and Lily were getting closer to each other. Today they all go for trekking together suddenly Lucy's health started getting worse. Lucy stops at a place to rest and falls asleep there when she woke up she didn't find Teji and Lily. She was very disturbed by this quickly gets down and comes to town. She saw these two in the hotel she tells them that both of you had left me like this what's going on between you Lily said that we had put a note in your shirt. Lucy feels bad and starts running from here. Teji follows her Teji hugs her says everything is fine. I love you so much when their trip ended Teji dropped Lucy at the station. Lucy had one thing left behind so when she comes back and sees Lily and Teji there today Teji was taking Lily's photo it was confirmed that both of them were having an affair when she was telling all this to the police. Lucy says that I am guilty then she continued to tell the story further. Lucy had a hard break after that she did not want to live in the city she went to see Teji again and Lily was sitting there too. One day Lily came to say sorry to Lucy but Lucy doesn't forgive her. After Lily left. Lucy followed her the police were asking her about this at the first time now Lucy herself has said that she feel guilty because of this police arrests her. Next day the police came to know that the body they found was not that of Lily now again the police ask Lucy, statement you gave was wrong what happened in actual. Lucy says that I wanted Lily to die and that's why she blamed herself she tells that when she was young her brothers and friends were stoning her together. Lucy got angry with this she pushed his brother due to the push his brother got hurt and he died. Everyone explained to Lucy that there was only an accident but the way Lucy was seen by his parents she felt that they always blamed her this thing was always eaten by Lucy and for this reason she left home and came to Japan. The police officers explained to her that you are only in the guilt but this does not make you a murderer after this they left Lucy. Teji was missing for a few days the police think that maybe both Teji and Lily have run away. Lucy comes directly to Teji's house there she saw the file of photos her name was also in this file. She looked at her photos separately after that the photo of Lily had started in the last of these photos was the photo of Lily's dead body. This photo was taken at Teji's house it means Teji killed Lily as we know. 
Lily forgot about the important event maybe that's why Taiji got angry and killed her. Lucy went to the police station with this photo but tonight there was no officer there after this she comes to the house but there she sees Taiji. Taiji asks what did you tell them Lucy says I didn't tell anything Taiji says we will leave soon we will create a new life at one place everything will be perfect again and say sorry but Lucy refuses to come with him which makes Taiji very angry. Started beating Lucy a glass was also broken while hitting Lucy. Lucy takes this glass and hits him directly on the head due to this he died there now Lucy was again followed by death one day Lucy came to meet her friend Kato and tells her that death always follows me she considers herself responsible for Yamamoto death Kato said that there is no such thing as Yamamoto's death by falling down which stairs I had waxed it I would do this work only once in two years I was supposed to tell Yamamoto about it but I forgot so does this mean that she died because of me we cannot hold ourselves responsible for all these things, we don't have anything in our hands after hearing this, Lucy started crying at last he forgave herself the movie ends with this transformation of Lucy. Subscribe for more videos like this, turn on notification, and leave a like to help the channel out, thanks for watching.